Street News and Reviews. We back with another one, man. We got Tyrese on the stand. <laughs> yeah, it's been a lot of people taking the stand uh, recently, lot, right? Gosh. And Tyrese let us know that that whole taking somebody to court about the child support shit, that shit's a double-edged sword because his ass got ordered to pay, what was it? Uh, I think it was 633,000. No, no, it's 650,000. Dang, for yeah, this whole right. custody battle. And they're saying that uh Wednesday is when they laid it all out. He ordered to pay 636,000 with 237k going to his ex-wife Samantha, but 399k is going to the attorneys. That's robbery. That's robbery, dog. That's know. robbery. That's robbery. A, a, attorneys getting half a ticket almost. Sheesh. That's Sheesh. crazy, bro. Sheesh. I got to pay for you. I gotta pay for these expensive ass attorneys. That's crazy. Well, well damn, I, the the lady shouldn't be out of a. Well, before I get too deep in this, go ahead and hit the like button. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button early. Just get it out the way. We're trying to get to a thousand, but mm -hmm. we got your boy Tyrese. I mean, I think he played himself. You gonna say that he getting robbed? Let's see what this clip here is. This TMZ clip. <laughs> We also were hoping to accomplish sharing, shedding light on Samantha Gibson, making well over 100000 a year outside of what I make per year. And the necessary needs of the actual child are beyond met. Oh, I understand. And you're aware that if you pay these amounts and then the Court of Appeals reverses it, you don't get your money back. I am well aware. Okay. Yes, Do you want the court to consider um, you paying it into a, a, a bond so that in the right. event, whatever the court rules, no one, no one is prejudiced? I, I would, I would want to know more about what this means as far as a bond, but if I could position myself to show any intentionality to to do that if that's the final final outcome then i'll take care of it but doing something that is beyond the scope of the law it feels like punishment it feels like it's it's just unnecessary and if the roles were reversed i just really feel like i wouldn't be sitting here so which is it? Is it a racist thing or is it a a sexism type of thing? He said if the roles was reversed. What does he mean by that? He means that the court system is pretty much in favor of women in our justice system. You hey, know. Hey, listen, <laughs> I think that he might be right, but I'm gonna tell you about <laughs> an anecdotal experience with me. You know M. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I know my homeboy, he went to court. No, the, the baby mama felt like he wasn't paying enough child support. Ended up getting less after going to court. Like his shit was in the double digits. Mm, so the baby mama took him to court to get more money. And it, ended up, it getting, ended up getting way less. Because you don't I've know how much that. his money make. Yeah, because they don't know how much he's making. But somebody like Tyrese is probably a lot different. They know he banking in. You know, he probably got some real estate. He got a lot of different assets making money. You know, I'm just saying that bitch could go either way. And now keep yeah, in mind, this yeah, is why I feel like way. he played himself. And granted, I don't have <laughs> any kids. I never been on child support. So I know that my opinion don't hold a lot of weight to some people. But I feel like he played himself. And we're going to look at the facts. What? He was ordered to pay 10000 monthly in child support, but instead was only paying a little over 2000 and rationalized the decision to do so by telling the judge that his ex-wife makes good money on her own and that 10000 was an excessive amount. As a result, his attorney said that they plan to appeal the decision that the judge ordered, um, and they've already filed an emotion. That's, uh, I'm reading from a quote from The Root. So this man already had a sweet deal. I think Tyrese could, could probably uh manage the 10k a month 
and this ain't no regular know, baby man he didn't hold on he ain't dropped no baby boy two out of nothing now he ain't been in the movies in a couple years man this fast is mr and fast and furious nigga. don't <laughs> don't don't play broke nigga. you want to be uh you know what I'm saying highfalutin this shit, showing your teeth and, and tap dancing all this shit. now you want to play broke nigga. you got that money though you probably could have sworn to 10k and then you want to get that lady 2k a little under 2k nigga, this ain't no regular baby this a tyrese baby you gotta pay that money so that you played with the people and now they got you paying the back child support you told your ass you could have just paid what they were saying beforehand it's your jet who don't worry about what she's making so what the mama making good money you tyrese the baby gotta have the same standard of living at the mama house or at least comparable you feel me you can't you can't be living in the hills and then when he go back to the mama house he in the hood no nigga that's not how that work. You That's feel me, up, bro? <laughs> I'm just keeping it real with you. So the baby, so the baby, the baby, right? He's supposed to live mm-hmm. like a, a Tyrese type of quality of life. He just got to depend on the mama hundred k a year. No, nah, me personally, I think it should be shared. I think both of them should have them a split amount of time and just take the money out. But unfortunately. It's so much money to be made with lawyers, judges, and the judicial system that they want some type of transaction. Because if you don't know, yeah. Let's (laughs) let's not forget, that's that's a quote from TMZ. 399K is going to the attorneys. So the real winner in this battle is the attorneys. attorneys. It's not the kids, bro. I mean, yeah, they go, but it's really the transaction of the money that has to be gone in the courts and all of that. but listen, have, choosing when to have kids is one of the most consequential decisions that a person will make in their lives when it comes mm-hmm. to money, right? This lady shouldn't be handicapped financially because she got a kid. Some niggas really will drag you and give you the bare minimum. Now, I'm not going to relitigate the case. I didn't see all I'm just judging off the information that we have available to us. Right. But it seemed like Tyrese was trying to get over because and then if you was paying more, then you should have been welcoming the chance to be on paperwork because then you got a receipt. Can't nobody, if I want to do more for my jit, then that's what I do. But nobody can never take me to court and say I'm not doing what I'm supposed to do. The fact that you could have been paying 10K and you, you was given around 2K, that sound a little fishy to me. And and niggas will act like that. As it sounds, they, fishy. It sounds fishy, but what I'm telling you is he probably don't got it like that. I mean, we don't know this man pockets. We don't, he ain't even want to know. He didn't even want to say how much he makes. He said, Hey man, my wife makes over hundred K. I mean, my ex makes over hundred K, including on what I make. So we be thinking that you know people run out of money people blow their money all things happen so yeah i'm thinking of it in this term if he needs to go through all of this bro something happened he know yeah, nigga, you, you know? need to you need to get on a legacy tour nigga. you need to call up <laughs> genuine and them boys nigga. people will still listen to sweet lady like yeah. he can still <laughs> he, he can, can still move around shit. Come on, man. I mean, this thing is a to, fast, bro. bro this thing is a fast and furious. And you know me, I don't mind being a little bit of a pocket watcher. Niggas don't like that, man. That we we watching niggas pockets, dog. We all see Fast and Furious and was like, damn, he getting to it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so that it's gonna be hard for you to sell that he's not popping anymore, type of thing, knowing that he's he he's out here, cuz he's out here. He got time as music, yeah. He got relevant time music. movies. He's in good shape. He looks like he can do his show right now. Yeah, but that's the thing, the image. People look at these rappers, people look at these singers, people look at these actors, and they think because they've been in the movie, they've been in movies and they doing something like they just got it. Like, and I can, I'm telling you, it's not like that, though. It's they got expenses, shit costs money. Like, I agree. I agree. All I'm saying is. <laughs> You might have to downsize a little bit. You got to have a little bit more than that 2K they talk about. Listen, I'm not in the man pockets, but they got you looking crazy out here, my G. Not, let's not forget, yeah. this guy is wild. Remember when he was breaking down on line, like, why? Why are they doing that to me? And then he, remember that was that yeah. scandal where he claimed that, 
or he asked Will Smith and them for money, or he he, he alleged that they gave them some money and they responded saying that we don't know what the hell he's talking about. And he said that he was on medication. He's known for being white. And then he said that this decision was because the judge is racist. Yeah, the judge might even be that, you know what I'm saying? But she might have got this one right. <laughs> I don't mean, even if she is, I don't mean she wrong about everything, you know what I'm saying? So he gonna try to rally the black community. That kind of that kind of rubbed me the wrong way a little bit too, because it'd be like the same artists that don't never talk about new, doing nothing for the black community. They not, you know, advocating mm -hmm. for no laws to get passed or nothing like that. Nothing that's going to like help people on that level. But as soon as you feel like a judge, a little bit racist, now everybody's supposed to be rallying with you. And he has some people outside of the courtroom uh, praying and shit like that. Did hey. you know about that? Yeah, I knew about that. And um, yeah, I mean, listen, I kind of feel Tyrese, I feel like he just trying to reach out for help. I feel like I don't know if I could say racist. I could say that it's probably sexist. I could say that they're probably going to want to bam a man. They don't give a fuck what color you wear. As long as you could pay these $3.99 in, uh, in lawyer fees and taxes, I mean, in, 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 court, in court costs and all of that stuff, it's a win for them. So yeah, it's like... Yeah. You know, that's where I think it's at. That we, that we could agree on that it's a win for the lawyers. 